Okay, guys, welcome back to Dirt 3. Uh, I've decided to do the Osiris off-road rush first. I took a peek into it, and yeah, I want to do this first. I'm sure it won't matter. We'll get to it all eventually. So let's start this right now and start with a rally. Look at this. We have a trailblazer coming up. Ooh, I can't wait. All right, rally race. Starting this bitch off. Many different... Oh, open. There's many different classes to choose from. This is probably going to be the faster of the... Yeah, here's an Evo. Evo 10. It's going to be 450 objective bonus. Is there only two here? Oh, there's an extra one now. This one here. 280 BHP. I don't really want to use the 207. The Sleeka. Opel, Opel Manta. You know what? I think I might use, well, 330. Let me see this. You know what? Fuck it. I'm going to use this. I don't care. 450 BHP is pretty good. Going with Oxy. We're, we haven't been with them in a while, but we're going to do it. See how the evil ha Evo handles the rally. Welcome to Norway, the land of the Vikings and once home to the Winter Olympians. With unrelenting snow and ice, this is a true test of all your driving skills. The only way to win here is to make sure you're always in control. Sounds like fun. All right, Evo, show me what you can do. I know what you can do. Shit, and I missed it. One second. Finish at 114k or faster. Okay. gonna do that i jinxed it with my awesome s speech hit the brakes damn i handled that well Come on, baby. Nice. Bad, we're good. Shit. You may have to repeat that, girl. Oh, fuck, I keep hitting triangle. Because that's what it is. I'm good. It's a little sketchy, but... Oh, I hit a man! I hit a man! <laughs> oh, that was funny. I fucked him up. 
Oh, sorry, bruh. It was an accident, I swear to God. Oh, man. Not going to be happy with me. No, you won't be. Oh, baby. Time to do one of my favies. Trailblazer. And they always hook the car up with like an insane body kit so it can handle the conditions. To cut through the sand and the dirt and shit. It's crazy awesome. But we're not there yet. Two rallies. All right, baby. And I missed it again. Let's see. All right, reach a speed of 133, I can do that. I managed to rescue that one. That was some risky biz. Whoa, shit! What was that about? Hit some notches. I don't know if this is going to be a good spot to start from. Oh, that was good. We're good. I actually made it. I'm catching up to two. Woo! Killing it, baby. All right. Keep up the momentum. You're doing great. More importantly, if the spots to send over any freebies, make sure you grab me some. I doubt that. Max Division, his name is Max Division. Didn't I have a beef with him earlier? Whoa, almost there. Very close. Starting to get way more rep for what I'm getting. Nice. All right, baby. Hey, Dan, you've been asked to take part in another publicity event. That'll give your rep a boost for sure. Jim Kana sprint. Oh, lovely. Okay. Um. All right, let's do the sprint trophy. So basically, a trailblazer is another point A to point B, but okay, you'll see. Trailblazer is the pinnacle of speed. Taking place on long, wide open tracks, you've got the perfect canvas to make your mark with the ultimate in off-road racing machines. Taming these lightweight vehicles is no easy feat, so make sure you're always on the right side of control. Just like rally, the race is a point to point with the times added across stages, so being the fastest driver is a good strategy for success. They're really, really wide. And right now I'm rolling with classics. Toyota Tacoma. Audi Quattro S1. Ooh, that sounds tempting. And then this is a regular 800 BHP. That's insane. Why? Wait, why? Why? This guy is offering me the most. 
Dalik Fada off road. They're offering me the most right now. Their vehicle is way lighter and more powerful. I love the Quattro though. It's a classic. But. The Audi Sport Quattro S1 Pikes Peak broke the unlimited hill climb record in 1987 when it was driven to the summit by Walter Rawl. Lighter than its Group B counterpart and with greater aerodynamics, it is one of the best hill climb cars of all time. Alright, but this one, they're going to give me so much. It's got way more. Look at the 800 bhp. Crazy. We're rolling in the classics today, boys. I loved these. Although the last ones were um the last the last okay, the la they'll have like regular vehicles too, like the I'll Evo and things like that. There, but they have a special last race is any indication, tuning to them. Nothing to worry about. God, this this truck, it's basically a truck. Tacoma, isn't that that's a truck? <laughs> Alright, beat a time of one thirty seven. All right, baby. There's not as many tight bends. It's very open. And they're usually quite long. The tracks are long. This thing's handling is phenomenal. I got her. Well, that did not work the way I wanted it to work out. I just don't want to hit that bump. What did I get? 128. Damn, I schooled it. Holy shit. I came close. Lynch almost caught up with me. That was fun. Lots of speed. Driven. I think that's uh, taking... Well, no, then, the, then there's Rampage, yeah? And I remember Rampage being like Land Rush, but instead of point A to point B... No. Which was which? No, Rampage was like point A to point B, but with like heavier vehicles. Right? And then like Land Rush was like a circuit event. Like, it's like Rally Cross, except with the bigger vehicles. I don't know, man. We'll figure it out. Oh, there's two events. Nice. I got this. Reach a speed of 197. I can do that. Holy shit! Easy girl.
My chin is itchy as fuck. Oh! Now's a chance. Okay. <laughs> there we go. It was distraction. Holy crap, man. That's some fastness. That was awesome. Woo, I left those bastards way in the back. Looking great out there. Hey, you always look great out there. Thanks. But he always wants to chime in and make me feel good about myself. Have you noticed that? <laughs> Bit of a try hard, this one. That's a fast car. Well, I'm going to be rank 8 right now. Who'd I get? Garmin. Hey, man. When I was in Miami, I had a Garmin GPS. It led me to fucking Timbuktu just about. It told me to take exits that I wasn't supposed to take. Like, it was so broken. Like, seriously, it'd be like, take exit. And it would clearly descript, like give you a description of the exit you're supposed to take. I took it, and as I was taking the exit, it's like, no, stay on this. Now, make a U-turn where illegal. And I'm like, fuck you. For the finals. Have your autograph. Seriously, this is fantastic. The way things are going, I think you have an excellent chance of qualifying for the Summer X Games later this season. Everyone settle down. Let's start by winning this final and take it from there, okay? Okay, guys, um, I'd like to go, you know, here. Rallycross. Kwai Antoine. Seven laps. It's probably a really small track. All right, so an Evo 10 with... They're going to give me the most, so yeah, I guess. Ma well, we'll see. I like the Evo. I'm, I'm happy to drive it. Not a problem. How, like, how much does this shit cost? Just to, like... These vehicles alone are so expensive. I don't doubt that. All the performance mods and everything. I mean, they do rip everything out, so there are, isn't Welcome a whole lot Monica. in there. From the harbor to strictly the hotels, for racing. This is the glitziest place you'll ever compete. But don't let the sunny skies and glamorous celebrities fool you. There's plenty of asphalt on these tracks, so the speeds are going to be among the fastest you've ever encountered. A lot of people say they don't like Rallycross. They think it's stupid because it's like, it's like standard racing, but it's a mix of both dirt and asphalt. Wow, this is actually the Monaco Speedway. I recognize it from Top Gear. <laughs> Whoa, Spazzy McGee over here. Wait, this, this, isn't this dude like a legend, Mohammed Ben Sulaim? Oh! Woo! Damn right! That was a nice drift. He helped me with it. Assisted drift from Mohammed himself. Shit! That's okay, we can recover. Get that turbo going. Got it, baby. Oh, no! We're good. We're good. That was a bit of a bounce. <laughs> oh, 
My bumper's on the track. Go, man, go! Bringing my Evo through its paces. Almost there, one more lap after this one. I love that turbo flutter, do you hear that? <laughs> so nice. Oh no, that did not work. Damn it, I'm gonna... That's just too much. Too much slagging. There, perfect. If I'd done it any later, I would've been hooped. I'll take that over the other one anyway. Nice. -a. Woo. Crazy beans. A lot of diversity here. No Americans. That was I a wild race, but you know what they say? Most sports take one ball, this one takes two. And it better be solid. So wait, is there another one or No. No, maybe there is. I can't remember. Nope. It's kind of basic because it was on 100% asphalt because it's Monaco. See, this is what people didn't like about Rallycross. It's weird. Because that wasn't really a Rallycross stage, to be honest. Alright, we have a Gymkhana Sprint. And then we're on the Rush Final. This one's a Gymkhana Sprint Challenge. Pull off the tricks in the order shown and get to the end as fast as you can. If you miss a trick, you'll have to go back for it, so stay focused. Oh dear. They're giving me the STI. It's what Ken used to roll in. Crawford performance. That's right. I haven't seen a donut or a drift that could stop you yet. Let's win this thing. All right, baby. Are there are there actually going to be people watching me or probably not? Nice. That wasn't so bad. Got that gold though. Gold medal performance. Barely, but I got it. Nice.
I was selling for golds on the Gymkhana, just because they're kind of tricky. If you really practice the courses, though, you'll be you'll be fine. Because each time you're given a different type of vehicle that's like very, very different from everything else. <coughs> Lots of rep for that. But now we're officially on to the final. Here we go. The Marina face-off with two rounds. So I can go from the open. Garmin is giving me an STI with 600 bonus. What are these guys giving me? Anything? No, that's a 207. Oh, another Garmin. 600 bonus. Lancia Delta. I just said I wanted a Delta. Let's see. What's better? 330. What was the other one? 220, 295, so it's got uh, 300, or 35 more horses than this does. Let's see how, how heavy it is. This weighs more. What do I want? Ah, oh, God. And they both have 600, yeah? I'm taking the Delta. I won't get to drive it that often, so I'm going to do it. The Delta was one of the better, if not the, one, well, I wouldn't say the, one of the best rally cars ever. In my opinion. Very basic looking thing, but it was pretty beastly. Lancia kind of dropped off the face of the earth. You must love the spotlight. You've been doing really well in head-to-head -head events recently. Let's keep it up. All right. Reach a speed of 153K. I'm pretty sure I could do that and get 600 extra. All right, Garmin, take me to victory. Oh no! Oh shit! That would have been nice if I kissed it a little better. No! Oh my god! Seriously? Come on, man! I got this. Fucker's beating me. Come on. Come on, Lancia. Don't let me down. Still ahead, come on. Easy left. To finish. Yeah, we did it. Me and my Delta. Oh, there's a couple of here. Look at that. 
Not there's like three rounds. No. Yeah, I think there's a four rounds. No, I think there's three. I don't know, man. We'll figure it out. I remember uh, I we read about something. I was with my uh, girlfriend and her parents. And uh, there was something where they'd let you drive a, a, a rally circuit, like obviously with somebody, but they'd let you drive it and you can choose from a variety of vehicles. And some were like, you know, you can get an, an Evo, you know, stuff like that. They even gave you an M5 and, and the, they also offered a Lancia Delta. And I remember my, uh, my girlfriend's mom was just all like, oh, I take the, the BMW. I'm like, you would, but you don't understand. It's funny because uh, my girlfriend's dad and I both share the same love of cars. So we both knew it. I'm like, I take the Delta instantly. And he's like, oh, yeah. Like, when do you get a chance to drive a fucking Lancia Delta? You never do. They're so rare. I can go out and drive an M5. Whatever. Who gives a shit? I want to drive me a Delta. The man's name is Jens Axelson. Hold on. What's my objective? Overall time of 139. Oh, fuck, that same turn. Fucking horseshoe. I'm trying to be quick here. Horrible. Come on, Lancia, help me out. Oh, he's getting away. Come on, top speed. Here we go. Once again, they lose us. <laughs> looking good, looking good, looking fine. One more. Darren Lynch and I, once again, in the final. She's a beauty. Come on, man. Final round. Let's wrap this bitch up. Take Garmin home. Oh, shit. They're like, this is the final send-off. All right, reach a speed 153. I can do that. Nice start. Bad, bad, bad. That was bad. Oh, I gotta get that. It just doesn't have enough swing as I'd like it to. No, that was a dead stop. Here's 153. 
Can't have that. I'm behind. God, it's close. Stretch! To Woo! You know that be mine. You know it. It's close though, man. Well, I mean, it seemed like it. Me and my Lantia. Lantian and I. Okay, that's another one in the books. The extra mile. Don't know what that's for. Oh, 2,000 rep. That's going to give me to level 9. And three objectives complete. Wow. Kenwood. Nice. I'll be have a banging sound system while I'm racing. All right, that one is technically done. Now I'm gonna move on to Smith Rampage. All right, we'll be back. <laughs>